I'm here at the hospital, St. Joseph's Hospital. As you guys can see, there is a, a lot of police activity here. Let me show you around. More might be coming. Now, this is in relationship to uh, an incident at uh, on Park Hill and St. Casimir. Uh, we hear that uh, there was an emotional disturbed person uh, banging in the car and uh, many police uh, cruises there. Now they came to the, to the hospital probably to bring the person. The person might be inside, don't know at this time, don't know if the person is in the ambulance, I'm sorry, in the police cruiser or not, possibly not. But as you guys can see, they hear. Let me show you how many police cruisers. There is two police cars there. There is another one there. ESU. And another ESU. For those asking what's going on, well, the incident happened on Park Hill, Park Hill in Linden. I am being told that this is in relationship to an emotional disturbed person that was inside of a vehicle or inside of a house. Um, not sure because sometimes, you know, uh, people give me information, but the information is not correct. Another police cruiser just arrived. Sometimes I get information, but the information is not 100%. So some people told me that uh, the emotionally disturbed person was inside of a car. Some people told me inside of an apartment. Uh, there was a big commotion, lots of police uh, on Park Hill. And this is all related to this. La gente que habla español preguntando qué está pasando aquí en el hospital, por qué tantos carros de policía. Quizás algunos de ustedes escucharon a policía en Park Hill, en Linden. Eh, me dicen que una persona em, disturbada emocionalmente eh, y quizás ya llegó al hospital o quizás lo están trayendo porque continúe escuchando la ambulancia. Pronto, aquí están uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete carros de la policía acá. A otro carro de la policía está llegando. Miren, otro. Otros dos carros. What's up, buddy? How you doing? Okay, I can hear the person banging inside, inside the police cruisers, the police cruiser. I don't know if you guys heard it. That's the reason why so many police here. The emotional disturbed person is inside one of those cruisers. He's inside one of those cruisers. Let me see where can I get the best image from.
the officers are getting ready. I guess he was very violent. That's why uh, the police, not the ambulance. I can see he is on that vehicle, on that cruiser that has both doors open. He's talking to the police officers. I don't know what he's saying, but he's talking to the police officers. I don't know if you guys can see a, a, fla a light that is flashing inside the cruiser. The officers are all there, very patient, waiting. I don't know what they're waiting for. They know exactly what they're doing. But from this point, I don't know what, uh, what are they doing. Probably making sure that everyone is safe before they take the, the patient out. I don't know if you guys could see, but uh, the officers or the hospital staff, they covered the, the man. They covered the man's head with uh, uh, something that looked like a bag, bluish bag, a net, probably so he wouldn't bite or spit on anybody. <laughs> 